This is actually my helmet. So this is the, this is a Gen 3 uh, helmet. It's about four pounds or so. It's custom fit to each of the F-35 pilots. And it has a couple of different kind of external features that I'll show you. And then to drop the main visor, it drops down and locks. And then you can put down the dark visor. This is the projection visor or the, or the internal visor. And so the two projectors that uh, you can see that I'm pointing at here project an image down onto uh, to the internal visor, the projection visor, if you will. What are you able to see then also uh, in, in your helmet? Everything that I'll need at any moment for critical actions, i.e. knowing navigational and flight information is being projected and shown to me at any given time. I have directions about the weapons that I'm carrying or any kind of targets that I have selected. Um, all that information is on axis. It projects an image of what's outside of the aircraft to me. So for instance, if I look down uh, at my legs, I will see the image projected from the camera below the aircraft. With the aid of the F-35 HMD, the pilot can view the ground directly beneath the aircraft through the cockpit floor during his vertical descent to a safe landing. I'm not actually looking through it, but I'm, I'm being projected an image of what is below me. And so you can still see your legs, of course, but you can also see the image that is projected uh, from what's below you or to your left or to your right. As we came in, uh, you said, well, have a look. It's very interesting, but do be careful because it has a good reason, I think. Yeah, it's very expensive. Uh, it's about uh, a half a million U.S. dollars per copy uh, or so. But the expense is uh, is because of the of the lightweight nature of it, the materials that it's made out of. So it's actually quite comfortable to fly an F-35. Uh, yeah, com yeah, it, you know, comfort is in the uh, is relative, I, su I, I suppose. But uh, it is relatively comfortable to fly the, air the aircraft. I, I don't notice the equipment uh, anymore. It was different when I first transitioned in. Uh, you were uh, cognizant of all the things that were around you that were different. But now I put the gear on and I, I'm, I don't even think about it anymore.